welcome back in this channel again okay so today or this time i will go to a black sand beach we call it saba beach maybe not a lot of you know about this beach because this beach is not really uh, popular guys but however uh, if you're staying in ubud it is um can be an option for you if you like to go to the beach because the location is uh, maybe like 20 30 minutes drive from ubud and if you don't know the location i put the Google map location in my video descriptions so you can check there okay so let's go and see how is this beach guys Okay, so I just arrived here at the parking area and I will go to the beach but however around this area there are so many villas or hotels that you can also stay guys as you can see this is the example in front of us so they have some villas here it's Jiva Saba or something the name and this is the way to the beach and here there is a temple with really big trees it's banyan tree look at this guys so big huge here on the left side also there is a nice villa i think but i don't know the name maybe later we can see from the beach okay so this is the Saba beach it's black sand beach to enter this beach there is no entrance tickets guys and also there's no parking fee so it's totally free and this is the situation at the moment there are quite a lot of people local people enjoying their time here by the beach and it's really good I think because I don't see any plastics around which is really happy to see that and here there are some hotels as well we can see it from here it looks very nice hotel there and also uh, you can see the what you call that Mount Agung view guys it's very nice weather today so we can see uh, the Mount Agung from here I will try to zoom it so that you can see it clearly. Yep. Yeah. Sometimes when the weather is good, we can see it even clearer than this. Anyway, just for your information, this Mount Agung is the tallest or the highest volcano in Bali. And the second one is the Kintamani or Batur volcano, guys. Okay, so let's walk around here at this beach and let's see the situation. Anyway, this beach is not really good for surfing, I think. But however, if you like to do surfing, you can uh, go to Kramas Beach because there is a beach or Kramas Beach is very close from here where people like to do surfing. And sometimes they have kind of like 
uh, international event at Kramas Beach for surfing. But I'm not really sure if you can learn surfing there because um, how to say it's, I never see any um, advertisement or guys there that can teach you surfing. This beach is really quiet guys, so I think it's really good for you that if you want to relax and enjoy the view of the beach. And however, just for your information, there is no restaurants around here or food sellers, drink sellers. So if you like to have your food or drinks, you need to get it before you uh, come to this beach. Like us, we're bringing our own food guys. I, we bought it just on the way to this beach and I'll show you what I have. So, this one we call nasi kuning in Bali or yellow rice and it has some noodle This one is the, what you call that? Sambal, yeah, very spicy So, if you don't eat spicy food, uh, you can just skip this and we have chicken and also uh, this one we call bragadel yeah it is um, a fried of um, what you call that corn. it has corn and some uh, flour and also some vegetables and you can try when you are in bali once in lifetime maybe local food Okay everyone, that's all for today's video from the Saba Beach. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to support me by subscribing this channel. See you again in the next video. Thank you very much and bye now.